hello friends today i'm going to show you how to install red hat linux 7.4 in vmware workstation the uh, vmware workstation i am using is workstation 15 pro here you can see that i am using workstation pro and also go to help and click about vmware workstation here you can see that i am using 15.0.1 build and this is the build version of vmware workstation this is the updated version of uh, up to uh, right now okay now uh, create new virtual machine and select custom and click next next uh, select this I will install operating system later next here select Linux and Red Hat Art is automatically selected okay uh, here I am giving this in location only no problem okay next next I am using NAT connection okay click next 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 yeah create new virtual hard disk but here i am showing a single file i don't want to into multiple files click next next click finish here go to edit virtual virtual machine settings and go to cd and sata here check the bus use iso mail and browse here go to location where you store the uh, red hat linux image iso image click open and click ok and select power on here within 50 uh, select red hat linux enterprise and wait further instructions here select language and click continue here date and time is already selected if you want your uh, different network I am from India so I am select from India ok um, click done ok if keyboard I am, I am comfortable with VS if you are from other uh, click a plus button and select your la country uh, keyboard ok click done installation source is auto detected no problem why because uh, local media click software selection here I want to install Red Hat Linux 7.4 with GUI mode so here I am selecting server with GUI I don't want to add extra options uh, click done here installation source is checking no problem here the beginning installation is option is grayed out why because we need to select uh, complete another steps here click on settings here ok right now I have given 20 GB is enough why because the, all these I am showing for practical purpose only if I want to configure partitions I will use this option manually right now I don't require in the in the real time production we have to uh, we have to manually partition uh, partition the hard disk as per requirements clicks done yes mm, no one. yes click done click the network connection and select on button okay this is my virtual ethernet card mac address and this is the ip i am getting from that my network okay click begin installation and here click the root password and okay the password is not getting right okay here 
I'm giving okay click the difficult password and click as done now the pa root password is there now user I don't know right now I don't have any user so after configuration if it is required I will create manually right now root is enough for me and wait for up to uh, initial uh, initialization get complete the ISO file is also available in the description with the evaluation edition okay once you downloaded the file and if you be satisfied with the video click please click the like button and comment your opinion in the comment section
the installation get completed and click reboot button Click I accept, click done, finish configuration. Forward, no, I prefer to click here button and click finish. Now select United States next next here local account type your name or account click next okay next next yes this is how my red hat linux 7.4 looks like okay now the click terminal here type hostname dot c t l here you can see that my computer starting name and the red hat operating system name and are check also with what privileges so i have logged in with the arsha name so like this you can also install the red hat linux 7.0 with gui version Thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Bye.